In this video, we're going to talk about how we can place a note and use association and select elements in a reference file, and that association will go across the reference file. Now, just to show you, the elements that you're seeing on the left part of the screen are in a reference file. If I hover my cursor over it, you can see it comes up, it says it's in a reference file. And if I go to my reference file dialog box, you'll see it listed there as base. I'll go ahead and turn it off, turn it back on, so you can see it's in a reference file. Now I'm going to use the place note tool. So I'm going to get to that by using the shortcut A2. And I'm going to go ahead and place in some text here. On the tool settings window, I want to make sure the settings are what I want. But most importantly, then in order for this to work, you're going to have to choose association at the bottom. Now if you see association on the tool settings window, but it's grayed out, you have to make sure that as a lock down here on the status bar, association is turned on should be turned on it's part of your seed file default settings but if it's not you can go down there and do that so now I'm going to place my note and I'm going to be snapping to an element in the reference file right here I'm going to place the note and there it is so now I'm going to activate the reference file and I'm going to be moving elements in the reference file so I'm going to move my cursor over an element in the reference file I'm going to press and hold the right button. The context menu appears. There are other ways to activate from the reference file dialog box, but I'm going to choose this method. So I'm going to choose activate. And when I do that, you'll notice that my text, my note, becomes grayed out. If I hover over it, it tells me it's not in an active reference file. So now I'm going to move the elements in my reference file. I'm going to use the move element tool. I'll go ahead and place a window around it like that. And I'm going to say I want to move it to the left or to the right. And when I do that, you'll notice that my note automatically changed. And now if I press and hold the right button, I can choose deactivate, and I'm back into my active file. So that's placing a note using association and having it go across reference files.